Okay, well, I just recorded this whole video and then realized that, whoa, my recording sound was all the way down, so you couldn't hear a single word I said the entire video. So now i got to redo this, just so you know what I do for you. Okay, so pretty much what I'm going to show you how to do is create your own skin for a CSS gun. So what you're going to do first is open GCFscape. I'll have downloads for every program you see here except Photoshop in the sidebar. So you open GCFscape, do open. Now you're going to go to my computer, local disk, and if you paid for Counter-Strike, then you're going to go Program Files, Steam, and then do what I do here, but I didn't pay for Counter-Strike. Hee <laughs> hee, I am tomorrow, actually, so I will have. But I'm going to choose Pack Steam, and what you're going to do is choose Steam Apps, no matter which one you have, and then you'll see Counter-Strike Source Shared. You're going to choose that one. Double-click it, then you're going to choose your C-Strike folder, then materials, then models, then you're going to scroll all the way down to weapons, V models, then you're going to choose which gun you want. I'm going to do my deagle because the deagle skin I have right now I hate. And you're going to double click the deagle skin 1.vtf or whatever gun it is, .vtf, not ref, but the, the one in the middle. Double click it, it'll open up VTF edit. I'll have the link for this in the description. Then you're going to go file, save as. And you're going to, oh, just kidding, wrong button. File, export, sorry, choose PNG. It's the highest quality you can get. Save it as whatever it's already named. Save. Now mine's saved right here, you can see. Now you're going to open up your picture editing software. You can use Paint. You can use Photoshop, GIMP, whatever you want to use. Open it up. As you can see, I kind of already did this. But open it and then just... Do whatever you want to your gun, and no, I'm not being serious with this skin. This took me two seconds last video, so just do what you want to it. You can do anything. You could put a giant camo over it, and the entire gun will be camoed. It doesn't matter. Do whatever you want. I just put red lines for the sake of this. Then you're going to go File, Save As. And you're going to save it as the same thing, Deagle Skin 1, or whatever your gun is, .png. Make sure you save it as a PNG, and click Save. Then you're going to open up VTF Edit again. You see VTF Edit. You're going to go File, Import, and choose, mine's Deagle Skin 1. Choose your image. Leave those at default. Click OK. It'll load up whatever you just did. Obviously, I just failed because I didn't actually save it. But this is OK. Uh, this is, you're just going to go File, Save As choose VTF file, just save it as whatever the thing is already called, like this is Deagle Skin 1, so I'm going to save it as Deagle Skin 1 dot VTF, and you click save, no, why does it keep doing that to me, save, okay, there we go, now you'll see it appeared right here for me, now what you're going to do is go to put it in your Counter-Strike folder, you're going to go my computer, local disk, if you have Steam, go to your Steam folder, if you have Pack Steam or whatever, go to that, Steam apps, then you're going to choose your login name, then you're going to choose Counter Strike Source, C Strike, Materials, Models, Weapons, V Models, and then you're going to choose mine's Pistol under, or Pist underscore Deagle. If you're using a different gun, put whatever the actual name for the gun is and make a new folder for it. I already have this, obviously. You can see I already dragged my VTF in here. That's what you're going to do. You don't need your PNG. I don't know why I have that in there. Oh, cancel. Okay, but yeah, you're going to have your VTF in there. And now I'm going to stop this video and open up Counter-Strike so I can show you that. 